just got my September budget box from Pillowis and I figured let's unbox it together. I also have a discount code with Pillowis. It's artistry with beauty for 10% off. This is how this box came. It's a custom box for this month and it does say browsing. And when we open it, it's actually like a little keyboard situation. And then you open it and you get, for, it was for September, every order from Pillowis did get a flea, a flea, a flea, free blush. First product in the bundle is this Pillowis Oh So Beautiful Eyebrow Gel. Have I seen this before? Because I have tried a few other brow gels from Pillowis and I haven't liked them. No, this does seem to be with a different applicator. It does seem to be using the, oh, makeup base packaging and it's very liquidy so do have that in mind when you take it out it smells like glue interesting i'll give it a try personally haven't liked the previous eyebrow gel products from p louise i did find them a little bit <sighs> sticky to work with so we'll see how that works next in the box we have all of the new brow pencil gels bundles and I'm kind of disappointed because how can I say this in a very polite way? If you're just one person, what are you going to do with all of these? Like, yes, you can sell them, but I do feel that most people that get the budget box or even a subscription box are people who either cannot afford to be buying expensive makeup products. And yes, in a budget box, you do get your money's worth, don't get me wrong. Or a content creator who likes to use the brand's product and this is the way to get to save money essentially i haven't actually seen anyone using them and doing like full reviews so i'll definitely do that pretty sure i'll be in the shade espresso so it does come with a pen which is in a triangle shape like this you do also get a spoolie in the middle and at the bottom you do have a colored eyebrow gel so it's a two or three in one product which i kind of like i do like that it has a clean clear spoolie as well i'm not sure how hygienic that will be but yeah that's a problem for another day and last but not least this is an eyebrow palette i actually was really excited about seeing some, something like this because if you're a makeup artist you know how much things you have in your kit and i do feel like this something like this can be very useful to a lot of people I do. Oh, I don't know why I thought it's going. It was just going to be like a neutral, homemade type of palette, but it's actually cream and powder. I wonder if the cream can be used as an eye base. I'll actually have to test that theory. Overall, this is probably my least favorite budget box, and that's it for the Pillowis budget box. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments.